board bowl build along part two. Okay, now that we've got our riser glued on, we've got our marks for our rough bow dimensions where you can uh, cut them out. Now I've got the fence on my table saw set at 9 16 of an inch. <clears throat> we're going to take our stave, our board stave, and we're going to run it right up against the fence, being very careful. Actually, your hands should come nowhere near the blade. And we're going to stop about five inches. I've got another mark here. We're going to stop about five inches to allow for the curvature of the blade, and then we're going to clean it up with our bandsaw. Now, if you don't have a bandsaw or a table saw, you've got your dimensions drawn on there. You can use your block plane. You can use your sureform rasp. It's a lot more work, but it can be done pretty easily. Now, gloves, safety glasses, don't ever forget safety. Even a, a, a small power tool can tear up your hands really fast. Now, <clears throat> since we're fixing to cut the belly of our bow, we're going to have to redraw our lines for the width taper, but that's, that's no problem as soon as we get it cut out and cleaned up. We'll redraw those lines and we'll run those through. Okay. Here we go. It's raining outside, or I would actually be doing this in my driveway. Keep the dust down. Okay, you can see we cut our line, and like I said, all we're doing is removing the excess wood. We've got a uniform thickness all the way down, and we'll go over to our bandsaw and we'll clean that up on the next part.